Hi, in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to view the activity history on the Windows 11. So the first thing that you would like to do is just go and open your PC that contains your Windows 11 right now. And of course, if you want to upgrade into Windows uh, 11, if you are a Windows 10 user, you can just go and do it right now and for free, just through your settings. Of course, you can run the installation or the download of your PC. Oh, uh, sorry, in the background of your PC, if you want to keep using it in the meanwhile. Of course, your PC might be a bit slower, but it's not going to be a big problem, especially if you have a good PC. You will not even notice the difference. And once the download or installation is done, you will be notified to restart or to reboot your PC. When you do that, you will find yourself with Windows 11 ready to use. Of course, the upgrade from Windows 10 to 11 will not delete any files, any personal files or anything for you, so don't worry about this side. And of course, you will even have a recovery point if you want to go back into your Windows 10, maybe if you're facing some issues, which is not most likely to happen, or maybe if uh, you just like the Windows 10. But of course, when you get used to Windows 11, you'll like it much better, in my opinion. So, as we said in the beginning of our video, is we would like to view the activity history in Windows 11. So, the first thing this would like to do, we can just go and open settings by clicking at Windows I, or you can just go and open it with your regular way, click at the startup menu, and click at and this settings option where you can just go and look for it and of course once you are here make sure to go into your privacy and security which is the kind of before last option on the left panel here make sure to select it once you are here just simply you'll have to go into this activity history and click on it which is on the windows permissions options or section when you click on it as you can see First of all, you will have to turn on this store my active history or my activity history on this device. If you have it off, you will not be able to see it. If you, you will have to put it on so you can actually see it if you want to. And then you will be able to see it once it's on. So this will be actually for this tutorial. I hope you like it. Thank you guys for watching and goodbye.